The Song of Solomon, otherwise known as the Song of Songs, known in Hebrew as Shir Hashirim. I just want to read that. In verse 1, it says this, The Song of Songs, which is Solomon's. Now, the Talmud teaches that wherever we read the term Solomon, we can exchange it for the term Almighty, because the identification between the Almighty and his child Solomon is perfect and is complete. So this is the Song of Songs, which is the Almighty's. In other words, this is the love song of God for his people. And what a wonderful truth that is, that God is identified with us absolutely, completely and utterly. It's not that he's a God out there somewhere, way beyond somewhere that we have to try and make hear us and we have to call aloud so that he can he can somehow hear us wherever we are. He's the God who lives within us. He is always with us through thick and thin, through joy, through sorrow, through pain, through even through indifference. And we do get indifference sometimes. He is still there. He waits upon us and he waits to hear us address him and seek him again. He is always with us. Nothing can separate us, not only from the love of God, which is in Christ, but from God himself. Hallelujah. You remember Saul of Tarsus when he persecuted the church. Jesus encountered him on the road to Damascus, Damascus and said to him, he said, Saul, Saul, why do you persecute me? Not why do you persecute my church or my believers or my brothers and sisters? Why are you persecuting me? It was a staggering revelation to Saul of Tarsus that he never forgot. And he later became Paul the Apostle and he began blessing Christians. And Jesus, you imagine, could have encountered Paul then and said, Saul, Saul, thank you for blessing me. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It's a wonderful thing that we are totally identified with Jesus. He will safely take us to our destination. His destiny is ours. His future is ours. His fate is ours. His glory is we will share share in that glory. We will be there where he is. And he said this, didn't he? He said, I want them to be with me where I am. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus, for loving us so much that you will take us safely, bring us safely to that wonderful harbour, which is glory. Praise the Lord. If any of us happen to fall overboard through our own foolishness, you know who will dive in to save us. Jesus himself, our captain, the captain of our salvation. He is totally identified with us. And so this is the Song of Songs, which is Solomon's, which is the Almighty's. Hallelujah.